Hello, Double Talk 73 here, your fishing friend. What I'm going to try to show you now is a different way of floating, a float fishing for catfish at Mudwater River. And I use that term very loosely. <laughs> Turn my fan on here. It's a little warm. Okay. Alrighty. This is what I'm going to be using. I'm going to use my uh, Phoenix 1410, which is rated 22 pounds. Big River 6500, which is rated 19 pounds. I'm going to use uh, 2014 Floral, 15 pounds. A Slim bo slim Bobber, that's the key. A Slim Bobber, a 4 rod hook, and Large Cut. Now you use Large Cut, or you can use Crawfish. They both seem to work okay. Uh, I caught more trophies with the uh, large cut. The largest one I caught there so far is like a little over 12 pounds. That's a nice size trophy there. And the leader length is really not significant. Uh, I use 55. I like the number. <laughs> That's it. So let's go to mud water. And we're going to try to fish on a, a cloudy day. Start around 1 o'clock. See what the weather looks like. Okay. We're cloudy. One o'clock looks like a good time, doesn't it? So, let's go fishing. We don't have to go far. We don't have to do a lot of fancy stuff. This is essentially the same technique that I use up at uh, White Moose at night to fish for a trophy and uni lake trout. Okay? So, let's go see what one o'clock looks like. That looks good. So let's see what we can do. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cast out here and you watch my bobber. Down it goes. Now, what you got to do, you listen for your ding, your bite alarm, and then watch this number. When this number moves or you get a little blue on the bottom here, set the hook. You got a fish. Let's see what happens. It's a waiting game, just like any other fishing. Okay. Now watch that number. That's 65. It'll go to 58, 61, or something like that. Set your hook. Bring it in. As long as it gets on. It's got to take the bait. Get the hook in its mouth first. Catfish or bottom feeders. Here we go. That's how easy it is. Let's go one more. Now I leave the drag right where it is. That's a nice fish. There you go. 10 pounder. Let me show you where that marker is. What I'm doing really essentially is I'm just fishing in the, the deep channel that's there. This is the marker I'm aiming at, I believe. So there it is on large cut. But now there's a 12 pounder. That's at night. So it's 62.06 and 0 0.11. Then there's another one here as well. This one's late at night. It'll still work. 57.41 and 0.4.18. And don't worry about that. Okay, so let's try this other mark. Down she goes. Then after we catch another one with the large cut, we'll see what it does with the crawfish. If we catch another one. <laughs> no, no guarantee in a game, is there? This way you don't have to let your bobber float down, float down, float down, and reset. Float down, float down, float down, and reset. And I know they're also right out in here. Don't have a marker there, but I know they're there. Yeah. 
here, fishy, 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 here, fishy, fishy. I think 40 feet, I threw it a little short. Let's bring it in and get it back out there where I want it. There we go. Okay. Do -do -do. Ba -da -bum -bum. Thanks for watching. Give me a subscribe if you'd be so kind. And uh, hit that notification bell so whenever I come live or put up a new video, you'll know when it's there. There we go. Watch the numbers. Round and round she goes where she stops, nobody knows. And I don't know if it helped to shorten up that leader. There we go. That's it. And believe it or not, with this method, I haven't caught anything but trophies. And another nice one. Okay, now let's try a crawfish. Guess it helps go to bait, wouldn't it? And now, here's the other thing. You can use anywhere from 4-0 to 8 -o. I tried 9 and 10. They didn't seem to work. I got a lot of hits, but didn't catch any fish. So, four, six, or eight. Hot, that is. Now, I only had one crawfish a while ago, and I caught it, caught the fish somewhere else. I didn't think about looking. <laughs> I wasn't prepared. Remember my four, my five P's. P, 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 P. Practice, patience, persistence, preparedness will produce. And we're, what we're doing now, we're learning a little bit. Pass it on. That's the fisherman's way. So let's see what happens. I know they'll hit crawfish. Let's just see if we get lucky enough to catch one. But I showed that they hit large guys. Now, I'm not doing anything special. I'm not editing my videos. So, I mean, you can look at the time up there. We start at 1 o'clock. It's now 121. What we've caught, we've caught. A lot of times people fast forward to videos and uh, like the pro bass TV program, you know, guy sitting there casting, casting in, and then all of a sudden he's got a fish on. I mean, he might have fished for an hour before he got that fish on. Not liking that crawfish, are they? Let's give it a little incentive, maybe. Tease it a little bit. Might be crawfishers floats. The only one that'll, that'll get them. That's how I caught the other one. Earlier today in a comp was, was with a float and a crawfish. So I thought I'd try it here. We'll give it a couple more minutes and we'll put another large cut out there. Medium cut works too. There we go. Medium cut works too. Uh, if you want to catch the small ones... You go to uh, like a uh, number one hook and medium cut and you'll catch smaller catfish. Of course, the smallest one I caught was two pounds and something. Now, I know there's smaller out here, but two pounds is something the smallest one I've caught. Here we go. Got us a fish. <clears throat> so crawfish do work. <coughs> <coughs> this looks a little slower. There you go. That's how easy it is. So, thanks for watching. Take care. Stay well. Be safe. This is Double Talk 73. Your fishing friends saying, God bless you and your families. And uh, go fishing. Have some fun. So, happy trails to you. Till we meet again. And I'll catch you later. Y'all come back right here. Hey, come and join me on Twitch. I try to stream from 
Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday, if life doesn't get in the way, from 10:30 a.m. Excuse me, from 10 a.m. to noon uh, Eastern Standard Times, and I have been approved at Tier Three for custom comps, which means I get to award 100 for bait coins for first place, 50 for second, and 20 for third. So I'll have some comps out there and try to set them up the comps while I'm streaming. So that's about it for me. So I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.